Hello there App Spy viewers, it's me Peter and I've got a hands-on video for you. This time it's with Sky Tourist Blitz Trip. So uh, obviously this is a quick hands-on impressions kind of a deal, uh, not a full review or anything like that. And this is the sequel to Sky Tourist. And uh, it's very much a sequel because it's more of the same, essentially. Um, you control these two rockets on either side of the screen. Uh, the blue one's on the left, uh, red one's on the right. And uh, I can move my fingers about like that. And in the middle is a guy who has a helmet with a hook on it that is attached to this chain. And you move the little chap about by raising and lowering the rockets. So, I'm, go uh, I'm gonna try and move this, there we are. And the challenge is to get this little dude to collect all the lovely things, all these little yellow things, and also get to the end of the stage unscathed, and you'll have to figure out how to do that. So, moving blocks, moving little levers, that sort of thing, and then you get past these statues, and that's the end of the stage. It's ranked out of three stars, and it's pretty cool. Like I'm, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it as much as I like the original. I think the uh, controls work really well. They take some getting used to, simply because it's a different kind of control. Come on now, come on, and push. Yeah, there we go. And there we are, we can get past there. So it it's not just a it's not just a dumb action game. You do have to kind of think about how you're going to get through each stage. Let me show you the stages that there are. You know, there's a fair number, as you can see, I'm I'm up to level eleven now, so I'm not massively far through the game, but there's tons of challenges in there to keep you busy. Let's go to the latest stage. And you will see me try to finish this one live, because I haven't tried this one yet. So, okay, so I need to go push, no. So I can't push that. Can I go through here? Yes, I can go through there and collect these little blighters. Uh, so what happens if I, oh, my chain snapped. And obviously that's a game over. Got to restart the stage at that point. So what if I go through here? Is this alright? Yeah, that seems alright. Oh, nice. There we are. Managed to get through that. But I'm not exactly collecting these little pickups all of the time, and therefore... Uh, a bit too much tension on the chain. And therefore, um, you know, I'm not getting three stars, and, and that's going to be the main appeal for a lot of a lot of these people. Crimey, did you see that guy? He was huge. Let's go down here. Look at him, he's big. Oh! He's throwing stuff. It's not very nice. No thank you, sir. Ah, so that's pushed that down, so I've got to go back down. The game's come into a little bit of controversy for some of its little uh, character types that kind of go against you. Um, some people think it looks a little bit stereotypical of... Um, uh, sort of an ethnic minority. They look a little bit like gollywogs, basically, and gollywogs are a bit, hmm, a bit odd. Um, the developer has officially come out and said, "Oh, you know, we're really sorry. Um, we didn't, we didn't even know that this, you know, stereotype existed. Um, there's no, you know, we're not, we're not, we're not, we haven't tried to make the game like that. We're not making any message like that. So that's good. It's good that the the the, that the developers come out and responded uh, to that. But." Um, I don't know. I, I, I can kind of see the similarity, and at the same time, I can kind of just see that they're meant to be enemies that are a different, um, you know, they're different enough to kind of stand out against the really bright environment. Um, but it's unfortunate. It's an unfortunate likeness, definitely. Let's see. Can I go through here? What if I push this down here? Nope, nothing happens. Okay. Let me push this block. Nope, can't do that. Gosh, can't get through. Hmm, what shall I do? Can I push this down? No. Can I get through here now? Can I, 
Mm, no, but I can break the chain. Ah, gosh. But I, you know, I like the way that the game handles. I like the visuals generally. I think it looks pretty lovely. Very pretty. Very bright. And uh, the game is responsive. Um, it's interesting. Like, the gameplay is interesting. It's as interesting as the gameplay was last time. Hey, chap. Oh! Oh, dear. Sorry. Pushed him over. Oh, dear. That's, uh, that's quite embarrassing of me to... Uh, sorry about that. I want to push this out of the way. Is that possible? Go on. Go on. Go on. I must be able to push that. Hmm. Why can I not get through there? What's going on? I'll push this down. Whee! Oh, I've lost that block. Ah, darn. This stage is too difficult for me. Let's go back to a previous one. So, obviously, this is Sky Tourist Blitz Trip, the sequel to Sky Tourist, and I think it's pretty good. From what I have played so far, I think it's pretty fun, and if you liked the original, then you will definitely like this one, I reckon. Did you play the first one? Do let me know in those comments. This is Peter with AppSpy.com. We review. You decide.